welcome back on my channel in this video I'm gonna review a new beautiful magic little product and it's a jewel pot uh, eyeshadow from Charlotte Tilbury if you don't know Charlotte Tilbury landed finally in Italy at Sephora and uh, we are very happy to add this brand but I shop this product in particular on her website because it's still not available in Italy. So it's a new launch and maybe we need time to have all the range by Charlotte Tilbury at Sephora. But we are so happy. And now I want to show you the beautiful packaging of this product. So beautiful, glam everything about Charlotte Tilbury I mean and this is the box very very cute it has this beautiful sparkling this eyeshadow is available in two shades work of no shame and the iconic pillow talk I took a pillow talk shade but I think that also the other shade is amazing it's a, a deep rose gold shade instead this is about the iconic pillow talk shade so this is the color and you can see it has this little sparkling effect very very subtle very thin and elegant on the eye can really achieve this beautiful sparkling effect uh, without uh, having a very flash uh, glitter on your eyes. You see the color, now I apply with my finger, I swatch it on my hand but as you know in the second part of the video I show you how I apply it on my eyes. So this is how it's swatched on my hand. I don't know if in the camera you can see this beautiful little micro sparkling with the different colors also so it has this base uh, of pink and uh, this micro glitter you see very very thin and if you apply Tapping like this, you fix uh, the color, you can intensify the color, I mean. Instead, if you blend it like this, you can have a more fairy effect diffusing the color. So this eyeshadow has diamond powder for creating luminosity and um, having a natural glowing look. It's also infused with hyaluronic acid so it's very hydrating and vitamin e so nourishing and also argan oil macadamia oil and rosehip oil so it's like a uh, treatment also i'm wearing now on my eyes i use it as a base and then i tapped over my eyeshadow from this palette from charlotte tilbury it is starry eyes to hypnotize it has also a plastic cover to protect your eyeshadow and you have a powder consistency very soft smooth it's like a powder to cream i mean so very very beautiful to, to blend you see so luminous a very beautiful shade uh, really you can impress your finger a little bit and if I have to make a comparison I think uh, the closest formula is from hourglass scatter light I love this kind of eyeshadow and I really love this kind of eyeshadow by Charlotte Tilbury and it's like this so it's powder to, to cream formula very smooth also maybe mm, 
I have to say that uh, Charlotte Tilbury, this is Hourglass, for example. This is Blaze, the shade Blaze, it's more brown, brown stone. But I have to say that maybe the Charlotte Tilbury eyeshadow is more creamy when you apply it, it's smoother. It's uh, similar to Hourglass, not the same, but very, very close. I think this kind of uh, small curated collection always catch my eyes and um, they are very beautiful. I prefer little lunches like this than an entire collection, for example. So there are also two glosses to pair with this eyeshadow and uh, they look uh, beautiful i mean very very pretty but i decided to take only one eyeshadow to try so if you are new to my youtube channel please take a moment to subscribe because i have also many reviews uh, up to come if you're interested in this product and you want to see this beautiful eyeshadow in action follow the second part of the video so i'm gonna apply it directly with my fingertips and I apply it directly on my eyelids without any primer. The color is extremely beautiful. It's a very soft pink shade, very elegant, but you can notice even if it's uh, so subtle, even on a fair skin tone like mine for example, and it has a very micro glitter, very very thin and with um, iridescent colors. So let's move and apply better, tap in. I think a fingertips is the best way to apply this kind of eyeshadow. I can try also using a flat brush on the other eyes. You see, when I when I press it, the brush, it's a sort of cushion effect, but it's a, it's powder. It's not cream. Yes, you can apply also with a flat brush pressing a little bit but I think finger on yourself is uh, the better way you can achieve a beautiful result even more um, more fairy I think with uh, with a brush instead uh, with uh, your finger you can press the color and have a more intense uh, effect uh, you can see now they are similar so color and finish are very beautiful because the the color is um, a real warm pink uh, light pink uh, color and with this uh, sparkling very subtle very elegant you can also use it over an eyeshadow to create a different effect it's really made for uh, have a pop uh, effect uh, on your eyes and this color yes is uh, very suitable for almost uh, every skin tone i think because on medium skin tone it will be more um, more luminous instead uh, on fair skin tone like mine it gives you more uh, a deep color i think also the deeper shade uh, will be very very beautiful so let's move uh, using starry eyes to hypnotize palette uh, this very beautiful and limited edition from charlotte tilbury i'm gonna use this kind of shade to intensify my eyeshadow pink uh, is the new red for this fall so it's all about pink berry tones, warm tones, every kind of pink you can wear and look very glam. I know sometimes red is not a perfect shade to wear as an eyeshadow and I totally agree but um, in my opinion there is a kind 
of shade for everyone so maybe I can't wear pure red but I can wear something more red fuchsia shade and so it's just to play with the shade that is more suitable for you so don't give up if you are not friend to red maybe you have to find your shade of red I'm moving to this color Let's take an highlighter. This is Lancome Ombre Stilo. Call by Chanel in Ambre. And this kind of call is a very beautiful shade, but it makes me cry so much. And, and I want to try it again because it's a beautiful shade and it pairs so well with uh, this Charlotte Tilbury eyeshadow because it's a beautiful brown violet shade so let's see how it works here this is one of my thousand mini size from Chanel, Le Valium. You know I am a great fan of this mascara. So now let's go back to the eyeshadow and I'm gonna add a little bit in the center. Like a nice extra finish. And you can do it with every kind of eyeshadow you have. You can also apply over or use it or using it as a base very pretty pretty eyeshadow you see the sparkle using this blush from Dior so it's a glow backstage I read you in my channel so if you're interested to read a bit about it and now let's apply a little bit of pink and let's contour with your powder I don't have a new Charlotte Tilbury glosses so I use this lip gloss from Dior, it's fancy and so you can Wear a touch of color underneath and then apply your lip gloss or instead you can use it alone like this or apply a little bit of uh, lip pencil to to define more your lips so I hope this video could be helpful for you if it's so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me also on Instagram see you soon bye